Hello guys, welcome to another video. Wow, so actually I'm in Istanbul right now. It's really really been a long time since I've made a video in Istanbul. So I'm just so excited. Actually, I wasn't planning to come to Istanbul, but I had a friend from Ghana coming over. He was actually one of my very close friends from primary school, literally primary school. And then some other things happened, so we were separated. But finally, he informed me that he's coming to Turkey, Istanbul. So I said, wow, since it's been a long time, let me just come and meet him. So I've come to Istanbul and I've decided to just, you know, give you guys like some of the experience over here. Since it's been a long time, I said, why don't I just, you know, video some of what I'm going to experience over here and then share it to you guys. So right now I'm planning to take the ferry boat and let's just see how it goes. But I think before I even take it, let me just give you guys a brief view of the place over here and then we move on to the ferry boat. Let's go guys. So basically this is how the surrounding looks like. Yeah, so many people. Actually, Istanbul is home to over 16 million people. If I can remember correctly or even probably more that's just the number of recorded people but there may even be more than 60 million people over here as you can see it's actually crowded not only because the people are just 60 million but there are also like millions of tourists that come there are probably over a million people that go for tourism there are some people also doing their fishing stuff wow interesting i've actually never tried fishing before i'm thinking of doing it but i don't know when i'll do it so from here we can have a brief view of basically what's around this part of Istanbul. People don't mind think that this is the only part of Istanbul, but actually Istanbul is way way bigger than this place. So that is one of the ferry boats about today. We will be boarding one of those and we are going to the experience. Now we are heading towards the place where we are going to make payments to enter the ferry boat. As you can see far beyond there, there's that tower standing tall. So that's actually the Gata Tower. Actually, that mosque is the largest mosque in Turkey. And it's called Chamija Mosque. I've actually been there before. I think I have a video on that one. So if you're interested in seeing how the mosque looks like from the inside, you can check that my video. And I think you actually enjoyed the experience. I really did enjoy the experience, guys. Wow, so it's actually a good thing that we came earlier. So now I'll be able to save one of the best seats, which is actually, you know, the seats at the utmost floor of the ferry boat. So that's a good thing. Now I'm going to give you guys the view of the whole place. And as the ferry boat to moves, I'm going to be showing you guys around. From here, this is the amazing view we get. The amazing effect of the sun actually gives it some kind of green vibes. Wow, I really admire the amazing shine of the water right here. So I'd like us to take an aerial view of the location too. So this is the normal life that right here at Uskuda. Very, very beautiful and so many people just admiring the environment. Actually, there are other ferry boats available that go around the place. Some of them are meant for only transportation purposes, but some of them are also meant for tourism, as in touring the Bosphorus Strait. So as you can see, there are even some of the other ferry boats touring the whole place. Yes, very, very beautiful, just moving about, as you can see. And there are also different ferry boats at different points of Istanbul shores. That's actually moved to different places. So this is just one of the points that I've got into and I'm going to the other side, the European side actually. I'm currently in the Asian side. We are moving away from the port and we are moving towards the other side. Wow. It just feels so amazing to be about this guys. Just look at this. As you can see the water behind us too is in a different color. Something very, very interesting. And at the other side, so as you can see, we are going to be very beautiful view from the place. Wow, I think I have to start taking photos and not only videos <laughs> there's some kind of palace yeah so that used to be the palace of the ottoman kings i mean the last few ottoman kings that you know lived through the end of the ottoman empire that's where they used to actually run the country of so the ottoman empire itself wow so that seems like a really really huge yacht over there i'll probably try one of them and you guys experience one night wait is it me or is that some kind of like pirate ship <laughs> We are finally floating into the other side of Istanbul, the European side. 
So before I even continue talking about anything else, one thing I'd like to mention is that um, Istanbul is divided into two parts. Part of Istanbul is actually in Asia and the other part is in Europe. We just came from the Asian side. Yeah, that's a very, very tall tower. It's actually the tallest tower in Turkey. So we came from the Asian side and now we are moving to the European side. So many people think that Istanbul is all city and no green, or should I say no forestry, but actually there is a lot of forestry in Istanbul. There are even some parts within Istanbul, I mean deeper parts of Istanbul that are more greener than this, with less buildings. Um, I think I've had videos at some of the places. already got into the new no no and um, actually it's kind of hectic over here. I wasn't expecting things to be this much hectic because you know um, today is a working day. Today is actually Thursday. So for it to be this hectic is actually a surprise for me. But I just remember that you know tourists come anytime. So yeah there's no problem about that one. So now guys let me just give you a view of what I'm seeing here. There are actually so many local stuff that you can try over here. So I'll just give you a view of the place and I'll also just explain some of the things. Yeah, so over here as you can see there's this kind of shop, little shop or store here. So actually that's the meat. It's this kind of bagel, some kind of Turkish bagel. Very, very interesting thing that it has. It has some sesame seeds for it. And there are other things that you can try it with. Some kind of chocolates available and some kinds of um, cheese to different kinds available. You can try it with it. Also over here we're having some kind of bread with um, fish meals. They're actually different kinds I think. So you can also try any of them too. I think they also are amazing. I've actually tried some before. And they also have some um, some corn too over here. Different kinds. I think they... Okay, I think well, here is only the roasted corn that they have. And inside of the roasted corn, I don't know whether you guys can see that, but that's actually kestane. So kestane is basically uh, chestnuts. Yeah, some other restaurants that sell different kinds of stuff too. I can see there's some kind of drink stuff behind there. Um, I don't really know what it is, but I'll probably try it one time and see how it is like so guys i was finally able to meet with my friend and i was so excited to see him okay so now my child has come so i think i have to go but probably i'll continue shooting this video somewhere else and actually I'm excited to go through the Bosphorus Strait so I'm going to give you guys like the night view of the Bosphorus Strait as I go so I can't wait for you guys to see that's my right approaching guys um, I think we are going to <laughs> enter it from that side so let me move before people just you know <laughs> take all the space as I mentioned the night view from this place is actually much more amazing It's way more beautiful than how it's being displayed on the phone. Um, I'll just suggest that you guys come one day to Istanbul to try and have the experience. Or should I say the full experience since I'm doing part of the experience over here. So yeah, that's basically it. We started with our journey through the most first street. As I said, it's actually the street that's why the Istanbul is two parts, the Asian part and then the European part. 
Wow, guys, the yachts really look very nice at night. I'm just wondering how the experience is at night. One day, I think I have to board one of these yachts for a night tour across the, you know, the Bosphorus Street. And I'll actually take a video, of course. <laughs> I can't take such experiences without having you guys also experience it. So, guys, stay tuned for that one too. Wow, so actually this is the best lighting I've gotten throughout this night. <laughs> Anyways, thank you very much guys for watching this video. I actually did have a fun time, I enjoyed myself. We went through the Bosphorus Straits together during the day and even at night. And it was actually a very, very amazing experience, I think. I think even through the video, you guys saw how beautiful it is. We also went through the streets of Turkey during the day and also at night because I did show, you know, scenes as I was sitting in the tramway so that was basically the tramway experience and also the um, you know the street light experience at night it's actually i was planning to do much more today but because i had limited time i had actually bought my ticket back to my city because tomorrow i have lessons i have to get there you know early even though it's still late i need early to you know sleep and then wake up for tomorrow's lessons so i couldn't go around you know, tour around and as i said i came here for actually two things the main reason was to be my friend and i went to take something too so because of that i couldn't you know go around a lot but as i actually come to istanbul a lot so now that i've started taking videos again guys i'm going to take as much videos as i can give you guys the full experience of istanbul and even turkey because i'll go to other states too thank you very much guys once again for watching the video i hope you really enjoyed yourself please like the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel please just do anything to help my channel you know sharing it with your friends doing anything that will actually help it thank you very much once again goodbye see you in the next video